السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ یا ربی لک الحمد کما یم باغی لجلا لی وجی کا واجی میں سلطان اللہ ربنا لک الحمد بما خلقتنا و رزقتنا و حدیتنا و فرجت عنا اللہ لک الحمد بل ایمان ولک الحمد بل اسلام ولک الحمد بل قرآن اما بعد فاعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ربش رحلی صدری و یسر لی امری وحل العقدتم من لسانی یفقہ و قولی ربی زدنا علما اللہم فقیحنا فی الدین اللہم حاسبنا حساب یسیرا اللہم انہا نسالکا علما نافیا و عملا متقبلا و رسکن طیبا اللہم ثبتنا عند الموتی بلا الہ الا اللہ آمین یا رب العالمین اللہم صلی علی محمد و علی محمد اللہم صلی علی محمد و علی محمد اللہ صلی اللہ محمد علی محمد سو ان شاء اللہ ٹوڈے آور ٹاپک از گوئنگ ٹو بی اطاف فریگمنٹ اینڈ پوائنٹ آف فریگمنٹ سو فریگمنٹس آر ان سکسیشن ٹوڈے ان آور لیسن سو فار آئی ایم گنا کیپ اٹ سمپل ان شاء اللہ بیکاز دیز تھنگس ول کیپ ریپیٹنگ but uh, since uh, these uh, two fragments are coming into our lesson so i thought that uh, i need to teach them so you know what's going on so inshallah uh, what fragment we already learned so far did we learn any fragment the idafa fragment sister arhujar fragment idafa fragment we did not learn it yet did we Oh. Yeah, mudaf, mudaf ile. We did? Yes. yes. Oh, I forgot. I thought we didn't. Okay. And uh, Jar Majur fragment, right? Yes. So yes. these two fragments uh, we have uh, learned. And today we will see a lot of idafa fragment and pointer fragment in, the, in our uh, lesson. So inshallah, we can repeat our uh, these two fragments inshallah. And the pointer fragment, obviously, it is new for you. Okay, so, so far, um, basically, uh, fragments, there are going to be five fragments that we are going to learn in our basic Nahav class. So, what are these uh, five uh, uh, fragments? Harfu Jar fragment, Jar Majru, right? So, there are going to be some uh, Haruf. They come before the ism and they make this ism jar in status, right? And what are they? Can someone, uh, can someone uh, uh, say this list for me? What, what are harfu jar? Uh, ba, ta, kaf, lam, ya. Min. Not ya. We don't have ya. Uh, wow. Ba, wow. Wow. Yeah, sorry. بات کاف لام واو من فی ان الحت الا پرفیکٹ پرفیکٹ بارک اللہ فی کی سو وٹ از ڈو دے ہیو اینی اسٹیٹس دیز حروف ڈو دے ہیو اینی اسٹیٹس نو دے آر جس ہر بٹ دے او کینڈ ام اپ نی No, Mabni, uh, Mabni uh, thing is we use for the ism, not for the haroof. This is because Majroof. they just make the ism that comes after it, they make them jar status. Exactly. So the haroof does not have four properties. Okay. So status, number, gender, type is related to ism, ism. ism. Not, with, not to haroof. So if so, I ask you, what is the status of uh, this letter Ba? So since it has a Kasra, you're not going to say, okay, this is Jar. 
Can you say that? It is Jarin no. status? No. 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 Why not? Because it's not an S. Exactly. Okay. So uh, all these status, number, gender, all these four properties belongs to Isam only. For Haruf, we do not say that, okay, this is singular or this is plural or this is uh, Rafa, Nasab or Jal. That business does not count with Haruf. Okay, everyone? Okay. But Harufu Jar, they have a job. All Haruf that we are going to learn in uh, thro throughout our uh, grammar class, all Haruf, they do not have uh, um, their properties. Rather, they have a job. Right? So the job of Harufu uh, Jar is that they are going to make next is some Jar into status. Soon we are going to talk about Harfu Nasab. Since you see Harfu Jar, the job of the Harfu Jar, now what do you think? What would going to be the job of Harfu Nasab? To make uh, the next word um, Nasab. Exactly. So it is going It is going to have an ism. And this ism, uh, it's going to turn into Nasab status. Right? For example, we say Inna is one of them. So Inna is Nasab. You inna say laha. Inna Laha. You never ever say Inna Lahu or Inna Lahi. Right? Yes. So who is, because the default state of this word Allah should be what? Allahu. Right? Yes. But this Inna is working on it. And it is making it Allah. Asab. Right? So this is the job of this inna. So same harfujar, they have a job, and their job is that they are going to uh, make next is some jar and harfunasab. Since this is a har haruf, basically they are going to have a job. So the job of inna is that it is going to make some nasab in status. Then we have uh, Mudaf, Mudaf, Ilehi. Right? What is Mudaf? Line of Anjah. Exactly. So Mudaf, Mudaf, Ilehi, basically, it, they are a fragment. And uh, this is uh, basically Isam and Isam. Right? So this, uh, there are, are going to be two Isam side by side. They do not bear any long distance. And uh, the first Isam would be having no al, no tanmeen, right? And the second ism would be jarin status and this they show possession. Baytullahi, Rasulullahi, Kitabullahi, right? So all these are example of uh, idafa fragment. And then uh, we have a pointer fragment today we are going to talk about. So pointer fragment, for pointer we need to remember one thing that, uh, okay, it's on the next slide. So let's uh, finish this one. These two uh, fragment mentioned over here. So let's focus on them. And then we are going to talk about pointer fragment. So uh, there are going to be five fragments and the fragments that uh, we already learned are Harfujar. So harfujar is basically we are going to have a harf and isam after it, right? And that is going to create a jar, majur fragment. And uh, in Arabic term, we're going to call it murakkabe jari, right? And uh, we can call it jar majrur. And how we are going to label it, the word, whatever, all the haruf of jar, we're going to call or label it as harfujar. And then whatever is some after, which is jar majroor in status or jar in status, you're going to call it is some majroor. Make sense to everyone? Yes. yes. Sir. <laughs> then come idafa fragment. So idafa fragment, we say that it's going to happen between two isams. So let's say I have the word Rasulun and the word Allahu. So these are two isam I have. But now I want to create it off a fra fragment. I'm going to say uh, Rasul of Allah, subhanahu wa ta'ala. 
so what i have to do i have to make it light right so i need to make one harika because mudaf cannot have the mean mudaf has to be with one haraka it could be uh, dhamma fatha or kasra doesn't matter but it should be one haraka it cannot take the mean right hmm. so rasulullah and my second ism should be jar in status and when i say rasulullah meanings are rasul of allah allah so basically making first is some light no al right and no. second is some jar is giving me the meaning of in between now i can put the word of in between otherwise in arabic there is no word for of okay and how we are going to label it rasulu would be my mudaf right and the yeah. word allah he would be my mudafil so we we remember that stuff right yes so i think that uh, sister who is new we are revising that is from uh, gift from allah subhanahu wa taala that we are revising i forgot that we already did uh, idafa fragment so this is special gift towards you so for mudaf what is the two condition for mudaf is that it cannot take the mean no and al. it cannot take al what is the condition for mudaf ilayhi always jar in status okay simple and easy if we remember that we can easily uh, spot our mudaf mudaf ilayhi <coughs> sorry no i put some uh, practice over here kitabun what is the translation for kitabun book a book a book. Book. Ah, book don't say book don't say book. the book rather a ah, book allahu allah right allah. now i want to create it of a fragment how we can do that kitabun lahi very good so we need to take one harika away right and i need to take this u away and i need to put kasra here right so now yes. i have kitabullahi what is the translation the, the book, book of allah. allah the book of allah right good now kalamun zaidun two isms right <laughs> yes kalamu zaidin translation pen the pen, of, pen of, of zaid pen of zaid very good rajulun sayyaratun rajulu sayyaratu sayyarati sayyaratin translation would be the car, the, man, the, the car of the man the car, the car of the man, man. now i tr tricked you guys over here right you see rajulun before and sayyaratun after so you need to make sure when we are having idafa fragment that thing someone belong uh, someone uh, you know, someone belong to right that thing gonna come bef uh, before that person right mm -hmm. so it sh should be sayya sayyaratu rajul sayyaratu rajulin okay no. बुक राइट इज आफ्टर जईदून जईद इज दिस so always the person who belongs something will be after basically that mm -hmm. is going to be our mudafilahi okay make sure you know that you remember this now waladun baitun 
Baitul Waladin. Yeah, Baitul Waladin. House mm -hmm. of the child, the house of a child. Now, Al Kitabu Mudarrisun. How are we going to make that? Al Kitabu Mudarrisi. Risin. Oh, really? We can say Al Kitabu? No, no, no. no. No, no. no. Kitab. 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 So we need to remove this al. Oh, achha, achha. Kitab. Achha, achha. If it has al, then you cannot make it mudaf. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, the book of that um, book of teacher. Now, fee baitin. Now, see, I want to show you guys that our mudaf can be any status. Now, yes. fee baitin. What is fee? That's why baitin is a samajrur. Yes. yes. Now, I want to create a dafa fragment with that in the house of a Muslim. How I can do that? Baiti Muslim. So you're gonna say because... fee, right? Baiti. And now fee need is a majroor. You mm -hmm. are not going to deprive this fee uh, for is a majroor. You're gonna give it uh, uh, is a majroor, but you can make it light. <laughs> so instead, if you put thin, then you cannot make it mudaf. Mudaf, yeah. Right? So you need to remove Baiti. this uh, one harika. Baiti Muslim. Fee Baiti Muslim. Yes. Fee Baiti. Fee Baiti and then Muslim. you're going to say Muslim. Muslim. How are you going to translate? How are we going to translate? The house of the Muslim. In the house of Muslim. Yes. In, in the house of Muslim. Now, mm. in a house of Muslim, we can say. Could we put Al with the Baiti, Ustada? Fil Baiti, Muslim. We bite yeah. al Muslimin. We can yeah, you want to put al here? Yeah. No, no. Yeah, you can do it. Uh -huh. Fill Over bite. here? Yeah, with bite. Then it will be mm. our mudaf? No. No, no. No, no. no elephant lamb. You cannot take al. Okay, bite. let me write it down for you and see if it makes sense to you. Now you are saying fill baiti. Muslimin. Now you tell me, does this al bayti qualify for my mudaf? No, no. because no. al is no. al, al is there. Al is there, right? So then it should not be my mudaf. So I have to remove this al. Fi bayti, and then Mus I can give this one over here al muslimin, al muslimi, mm -hmm. right? Now you can say in the house of. Muslim. The Muslim. Of the Muslim. Mm -hmm. Right? Yes. Mudafilehi does not mind you give it all, you give it whatever. Just the concern of Mudafilehi is that it should be just it That's it. Right? Mm -hmm. But for my Mudaf, I need to remember two things. I cannot give it the mean. Right? And I cannot, this this is a big no. Or yeah. I cannot give a big no. Yes. Right? right? So you guys said that we already did that. But look how good we are at it. You're confused. Right? Yeah. So that's a good thing that we are revising it. Yeah. Yes. Okay, now next one. Tani. Will you please explain this, Rajirun Sayyarat? Sorry, 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 sorry. What happened? Okay. Yeah, sorry. Hmm? Rajirun Sayyarat, will you please explain? 
explain it again. Okay. So, Rajulun Sayyaratun, when I uh, creating a Dafa fragment, right? What does the Dafa fragment do? It creates a someone possess something. Someone, uh, uh, something belongs to someone. Now, yes. you tell me, Sayyaratun belongs to Rajulun or Rajulun belongs to Sayyaratun? Sayyaratun belongs to Sayyara. Sayyara. Gadi belongs to, the car belongs to man. Man does not belong to, uh, to car, right? Yes. So whoever the thing belongs to going to be after. It's going to be our mudafilehi. Okay. okay. Yeah. So whoever, for example, in the example of Baytullah, if we say Baytullah, yes, right. So this house belongs to who? Allah. This house Allah. belongs to Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, right? And this is my mudafilehi. So always remember that example. To the man. Okay, so same over here. I tricked you, a guy. I basically I put mudafi lehi first and mudaf after. Right? Yes. So then you need to figure it out that what should come first. So what about al kitabu mudarisun? Uh, then um, how, what is the who belongs to this book? Mudaris. This Mudaris. book belongs to Mudaris. The kitab, the kitab belongs to Mudaris. Yeah, so then, then it means kitab should be the first one, right? And Mudaris soon okay. is my mudafilehi, basically. Okay, so whatever belongs, it comes first. That is, okay, thank the you. The possessor, possessor will come late. Last. That is mudafilehi, basically. Yeah, yeah, that is the Just possessor. Just say mudafilehi. Mudafilehi is going to be, basically, uh, he is the possessor. And yes. now what we did over here, we just removed this all over here because our mm -hmm. mudaf should not have yeah. all. Mm. Okay? Now, fit dukani tajirun. How we can do that? this one here? Dukani. Fit dukani. Tajirin. Tajirin. Say it again. Tajirin. Translation. In the shop of the merchant. Yes. So what we are doing here, what changes we are making in this over here? Alif Lam. Uh, we yeah, we are removing it, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. So we can we are going to say fi duka ni tajiri tajirun even we say attajiru attajiri okay if we wanna make it proper we can say attajiri and what kind of uh, a uh, word is attajiri. We learn Marifa. about something shamsiya and kamriya. It's shamsiya. Uh, shamsiya. 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 That's why we are not saying al tajiri. We are saying attajiri. Right? So in the shop of the merchant or the businessman. Now fil kitabi and then the word allahu. What's going on here? Fi kitab illahi. Yeah, exactly. Fi kitab illahi. Not fil kitabi. We cannot do that, right? No. Can we do that? Fil kitabi? No. no. Why not? Because uh, in in the the mudaf cannot have in the... mudaf, have mudaf, mudaf. Both of them? No. No. no, no. Mudaf only mudaf. mudaf. As we are making uh, 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 kitabi is mudab in the second uh, fragment, that's why we cannot put al here. Yeah, Please so answer it. should be since we are making it, we are turning into mudaf, not mudaf, mudaf, ilahi, 
because our mudafi lahi can Love take it, al- hmm. it doesn't matter right mm-hmm. for mudafi lahi it is permissible to have al but that is the case for our mudaf so that's why we are going to drop this al over here right so fi kitabi and then kitab allah kitab allah in the book of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make sense yes now you guys see that okay our mudaf can be any status over here it was jar right over mm-hmm. here we say kitabullah so our mudaf is rafa now look at another example inna baitallah inna baita now this is baita why it is baita because of inna because of inna mm is to inna yes but it is not baitan why not why can because we mudaf, say because baitan? it is mudafli mudafli mudaf exactly okay not mudafli mudaf yeah yeah so we need to make it mudaf that's why we are not saying baitan right ji we are keeping it baita inna baitallah indeed the house of allah right so this is rafa uh, this is uh, nasab in status baitullah karimun the house of allah taala is very noble right so baitullah or fi baitillah sakinatun what It's is the translation in the house in the house of allah there is sakina there is subhanallah peace. yes in the house of allah is sakina there is peace 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 right so see our mudaf over here nasab over here rafa over here jar but look at mudaf ilahi always jar jar always jar right so we need to make note of all that stuff that is very uh, uh, sorry that is very valuable knowledge you are getting and you will see in quran e pak a lot of these things so you guys need to be very strong on it okay listen to this lecture one more time if it is not making sense to you right now yes yes please please Okay, next one. Ah, uh, we are going to talk about uh, pointer fragment. How many uh, fragments do? Uh, sorry, how many pointer do we know so far? Hazar, eleven, three. Like the Hazar, 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 Hazi, 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 and then we learn the plural one. Hazi, plural of Hazi, Hazi. right so haza hazihi and then haulai and then and these <coughs> are ismul uh, ishara lil qareeb right ya silka silka then we have okay someone is uh, turning over the pages so loud subhanallah yeah. oh, subhanallah it is all in the recording <laughs> so can we make sure that we are not making lot of noises yeah. okay then we have uh, uh, far Valika. fragment right Yes. Ismul ishara lil baid. What are they? Zalika, zalika, ulaika, zalika, zalika, ulaika, and then ulaika. Ulaika. Right. So at least six of them we know so far. Yes. Now we are going to learn more about these pointer. These pointer uh, can have can make a sentence or they can make they can have a. Uh, fragment. So what did I just said? These pointers, either they are going to make a sentence. They can make a sentence, or they can create a fragment. How we are going to differentiate? How we will know that? Okay, this time it is making a sentence, and this time it is making a fragment. how i am going to know this is what we are going to learn today so 
Padha Kalamun. This that was the thing that we have learned already, right? Yes. <laughs> Haza, this is right, but I'm translation translating for Haza. This is so I am saying is it is already in built in there. Haza Kalamun, mm -hmm. but then you see Hazal Kalamun. Do you see the difference between Haza Kalamun and Hazal Kalamun? What's yes. the difference? This is pen. This is a pen. Yeah, no, no, this by, is the pen. Just the by pen. looking the at pen. it, but do you uh, spot the difference? Elephant lamb. Alif lamb. Alif lamb, right? So when you see alif lamb after right after haza, you see an isam, <laughs> and this isam is proper. It has al on it. That means it is creating a fragment. Mm -hmm. And this time you are going to translation uh, uh, translate this uh, as this pen. This pen or this is a pen. What's the difference between this pen and this is a pen? One it's is a particular. sentence, one is a fragment. Exactly. <laughs> so Haza Kalamun, I do not have al after it. This is my sentence. And that's why, if you guys remember, that uh, Haza is considered an ism, right? Haza is considered what? It's an ism. Ism lishara is ism. This is an ism. And if after this ism, you do not have al after it, then you see that I translate it as this is. Meaning, is is inbuilt in there. Mm -hmm. Right? And do you remember saying me that, okay, the part before is and part after is? Muktada and cover. Exactly. Okay? So this haza is basically when it does not come with al, the next system does not have al, then basically this haza will always going to be play a, a role of muptada. So this haza is my muptada and kalamun is my khabar. But can I call this hazal kalamun as muptada khabar? No. no, it is a fragment. Because it is not yes. a sentence. Exactly. Okay, so Haza, now I'm going to call Haza as Ismulishara. And then I can further describe Ismulishara, Lil, uh, Lil Karib, and this is uh, Lil Muzakkar, right? <coughs> and then Kalamu, I'm going to call it, you need to remember one more term, Musharun. Musharun Lilai. So, Sadati, this slide is not added in the PDF, this and the previous one, which you did. Okay, practice. you guys need to, yeah, I did it last night. So, you guys can take a picture of it, no worries, okay? So, Musharun Ilai. Musharun Ilai, the thing that is being pointed to. So, over here, what is being pointed? The column, the pen, this pen, right? So this, uh, the Kalamu would be, Al Kalamu would be Musharun Ilai. Make sense? It's written it's over here. Is that the noun which comes after the pointer uh, pointer words, then that is called Musharun Ilai? Yes. If a noun with Al is coming oh, after the pointer yeah. fragment, um, right, achy, achy. it has to have all you need to remember that. Achy, achy. Okay, because achy. without all, we are labeling that as a muktada and khabar, right? Mm. <coughs> but when it is uh, with all, then it is creating a fragment, and that time you're gonna call this al kalamu as musharun ilay. Okay. Yeah. Another example, Hada Baitun. Translation? Haza. This is a house. 
this is. So where is my is over here in between? Why? Why? Because, because, because uh, of the mean. Yeah, because haza is an ism. So basically, that's why this is jumla ismia, right? And haza can be rafa, even though it is not showing us, right? So haza is my muptada. It is always going to be muptada. Then it does not have al after it. Okay, so haza is my muptada, baitun is my khabar. But over here, hazal baitu. What is the translation? This house. This house. So this is a fragment now. Right? Yes. So label haza, please. This will ishara lil khariqara. Lil khariqara. Very good. Lil muzakkar. Lil muzakkar. And what is al baitu? Haram, 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 if you say khabar. No. Right? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, so al baitu is our musharun ilay over here. Musharun ilay. Why? Because it has al on it. Al. One more time. Hada Rajulun translation. This is a man. Man, yep. This is a man. This is my Jumla Ismiya. Haza is my Muptada. Rajulun is my Khabar. But now I if I have Hazar Rajulu, now I see all over here. Fragment and Musharun Ilay. Yeah, so you're going to label it Ismul Ishara, Lil Kareeb, Lil Muzakkar, right? And then Arrajulu, you can say Musharun Ilay. Okay, I'm going to make it clear uh, all this writing so you guys can take a picture if you do not have in your slides. Okay, so first you can take picture of this one here. We have vocabulary at the end of each lesson. You guys can play around like that. Okay, put haza with it, make a sentence, then make a fragment, and then make your idafa fragment, right? So do not okay. just stick to whatever I'm giving you. You need to have your own cre uh, creativity with that, right? So now take a picture of this one if you don't have. Done? Yes. Yes. Okay. Does that make sense to everyone? Idafa yeah. fragment and pointer uh -huh. fragment. Uh -huh. Can someone repeat uh, when we are going uh -huh. to call uh, or we are going to see a pointer fragment and when we are going to see a sentence? In pointer fragments, after the pointer word, the ism will have al. Then it mm -hmm. is a fragment. And when this is, this is a... Just um, uh, is, isim with the uh, you can say isim nakira, mean? yeah, nakira, yeah, yeah, isim nakira, then it is a sentence, perfect. Okay, and how we are going to label it? So, if there is no al, then muktada. this haza is my muktada, right? And uh, kalam is my khabar, khabar, yeah, but over here, this al kitabu is my musharun ilay. Ilay. Yeah. Okay, so now let's see in our lesson. Okay, Jumla Ismiya. What is Jumla Ismiya? Anyone knows? That is, it's, it's not like that. It starts with the Ismiya. It starts with the Ismiya. It starts with the Ismiya. Okay, with Ism. if a no sentence, sentence starting, okay. Look at this uh, over here. 
you guys need to take a picture of this uh, this is uh, this is included in the pdf alhamdulillah oh, this is included okay yeah. so now look over here jumla ismia find the invisible is i told you guys that uh, there is no word for is r m in arabic right so there is no word for is r m so what happened we need to figure it out where we need to put our is so basically is is invisible in arabic we need to figure it out where i'm going to put my is so one thing is that whenever you see independent pronoun do we know independent pronouns what are they huwa huma hum hiya huma hunna anta antum antuma antum anti antuma antuna ana these are all our pronouns independent pronoun we did not learn uh, uh, the other pronouns there are two kinds of pronoun we have cousin of these pronouns as well so we didn't learn the whole family yet but uh, these are independent pronoun and all these independent pronoun they are always going to be our mubtada meaning they are always after them we are going to put our isarm mm -hmm. so if it is ana rabbuka how we going to translate what is ana mean i i pronoun i am i i am you going to put am as well right why because this is independent pronoun so whenever i have ind independent pronoun my is r m will go after it so ana and now what is rabuka your rab your rab your, your rab lord your lord yes. i am i am your yeah so that was uh, like firon talking i am your lord right so that was firon talking so now okay. i am ana is my mubtada and rabbuka that's what he was saying right mm -hmm. this rabbuka is the khabar now let's say uh, if i say huwa huwa muslimun huwa is uh, yeah. mubtada he is a muslim so how we gonna he is he is he is a mubtada he is ट्रुथफुल Anta right. is muktada and sadikun is khabar. Yeah, so Anta is muktada and sadikun is the khabar. Mm -hmm. So basically, what we are saying that whenever we have uh, independent pronoun, they basically that is our muktada, right? Yes. And our invisible is will go after our independent pronoun. Make sense? Yes. Then it says pointer words followed by by other than al. Right. Mm -hmm. Why other than al? Because if it was al, then it is not a sentence, right? It is fragment. Yeah. Yeah. So haza baytun. So whenever I have haza, my is will go after it. This is. Yeah. This is a house. So now Haza is my Mubtada, Baytun is my Khabar. Mm -hmm. Or I can say Zalika. Zalika Tajirun. Right? Zalika, that, yeah. So that is businessman. Yeah. So now Zalika is what? Mubtada. It's a Mishara Lil Baid. Baytun is the Khabar. Okay. Right? Right? and now this is my uh, pointer word right so pointer word basically always going to have is rm after them hmm. 
Okay. Then her phone NASA and its victim. Okay, so we did not touch it yet. So I'm gonna leave that alone. Then proper followed by common. If we have proper ism, and then we have a common ism after it, no. then our invisible is will go in between them. Al kitabu, the book is so, small. So we, you know, the book is small. Book is small. Yes. So now Al Kitabu is my Muptada, Sagirun is my Kabir. Then break in the chain. Basically, that happens uh, with all these fragments when they are. So we are going to talk about it later. So basically, this is uh, uh, what we have learned so far. If you see independent pronoun, your is will go there, is RM. If you see pointer words, but no al after it our is will be there and proper followed by common we will see a lot of example we see one in the in in our first lesson right mm -hmm. proper followed by common and there mm -hmm. was a sentence there uh, uh, the word is was in between them right and then break in the chain meaning when uh, two Isam does not have any further relation in between, then our is will go. For example, look over here, Alhamdu. Alhamdu means all praise and gratitude. All praises and gratitude. Oh. Now, Lillahi for Allah. What kind of uh, construction is Dharmaju? But do we have any relation of Alhamdu with Lilla, like any fragment, do you know? No. Nope. Right? So when um, there is break in the chain, Alhamdu does not have any relation, grammatical relation with no. this word Lillahi, then basically there is break in the chain. Right? When there is break in the chain, we can put our is there. So all praise and gratitude is for Allah. Right? So something like that. Inshallah, we are going to talk more about it. I'm just dropping hints on you guys. Okay? It's exceptional case. What? That's Alhamdulillah. It's an exceptional case. No, this is not, we did not learn it, uh, much so far. This is not exceptional. Oh. This is normal. Okay. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So now moving on. So now Jumla Ismiya. Then our sentence is starting with Ism. We call it Jumla Ismiya, right? <clears throat> And then we are going to have in Jumla Ismiya, we can look at two things, uh, rather three things, right? So there is going to be a Muptada, there is going to be a Khabar, and there can be MBK. So MBK. now Muptada and Khabar, sometimes you're going to have Khabar, sometimes you can have just MBK, right? And sometimes you're going to have both of them. So it depends on the sentence. So basically, these three ingredients make a Jumla Ismiya. What three things we need in Jumla Ismiya? Muqtada, Khabar, and MBK. Muqtada, Khabar, and MBK. So what is MBK? MBK, Mutalik, Bil, Khabar. So basically, MBK is anything jar majroor fragment or our special mudaf fragment yeah. Yeah. that is what lesson we learn our mudaf anyone remember what lesson number was it mudaf fragment yeah what num lesson number was that five lesson number Four. five Four. lesson Four. number five and did we do special mudaf in there no, we didn't. Kabla, Bada. No, we did that. No, we didn't. Special do. No, I think we did that. Kabla, Bada. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did it. 
Place and time, okay? Yes, yes, yes. So yes. when we have uh, time and place, something is above, under, right? Or yes, 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 we did it. Telling us the time. Tabla ba da hatta in the then exactly. Uh, yeah. 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 This perfect. Yeah. Yes. So they are special mudas, and when we have uh, them in Jumla Ismia, we're gonna label it as MBK. Uh, teacher, I have a question. Suppose hmm. um, uh, Bada, it could come like Badu also in the um, text or um, in the sentences. Always it will come at Badu or ba sometimes it could come as Bada also. Yeah, it it is flexible. Okay. Okay, not Badi, yeah. but uh, Bada you can find and Badu you can find yeah. and there is reason. Okay. Inshallah, we are going to talk about it, okay? Okay, Inshallah. So now, what we are focusing over here is that in Jumla Ismiya, we need three things. If I ask you to label Jumla Ismiya, you are going to look for Muqtada, which is going to be a proper ism. Muqtada is proper. Proper ism. Then you are also going to look at Khabar. And our khabar in like a regular Jumla Ismiya is supposed to be a common ism, but we will see a lot of exception in quran -e Park that even our khabar is proper ism. Okay, but it's supposed to be a common ism. And then our MBK, which is going to be Jar Majroor or Special Muta Fragment, we will see some sentences and inshallah as we label them, it will make sense to you guys. So let's see. Bismillah Rahman Rahim Ad-Darsu Thaminu. Lesson number eight. Hazar Rajulu Tajirun Vazalika Rajulu Tabibun. Can someone translate it? We can take turns. Who is ready? This is a man. Oh, this man is the merchant and that man is the doctor. Exactly. So, Hazar Rajulu Tajirun Vazalikar Rajulu Tabibun. Okay, let's do translation first of this page and inshallah then we can do labeling as well. Okay, next one. Next translation. Ismu Tadiri Mahmudun or Ismu Tabibi Saidun. Translation The name of the businessman is Mahmud, and the name of the doctor is Said. Mashallah, Barakallah Fiki. Next one. Okay. Hmm? This is a house of businessmen and that is a house of doctor. Not house of. It's not Mudaf Mudafi Lehi. That house is house. This is Machen's house and that is. Uh, so the this house, this house is for the for the merchant, and that, that house, house is for the, the doctor. Yeah, exactly. We cannot translate like a dafa fragment. We need to make sure what we are uh, doing because we have clear uh, construction mm -hmm. over here, right? So hazal baytu litajiri. There are two words, litajiri, right? For the La business. Or or, yes, Bata Kaplam. This house is. Yeah. So this house is for the merchant and that house is for the Tabib. And this is not Tayyab, Tabibun. What does Tabibun mean? Doctor. Doctor. Is doctor. Next one. Baitu Tajiri, Amam al Masjidi, wa Baitu Tabibi, Khalf al Madrasati. Translation. 
And that's why we are going to label it as MD. F, uh, MDK over here. Khalfa oh. is behind. So again, this is Zarf. Zarf Makan. Right? Yes. yes. Because it is telling us a place. Oh, then if we label it, you, you will we'll write uh, this is MDK. Khalfa yeah. Lima. Yeah, we are going to label it soon. Okay, so next move on. Liman has his Sayara too. Baliman Tilka. Hmm. Whose, whose car, car is, is this and, and whose car, car is, is that? that? Or and who's is for that? who? Uh, sorry. For who? Um, uh, who whose, uh, whose car is this mm -hmm. and for who uh, is that? Okay, perfect. Yes. Next one. Hadi Sayaratu Ritabibi, what Tilka Ritajiri? This. This is car of uh, the doctor, and is, that is car is for the doctor. No, oh. you know, this car is, is for the doctor, uh, and that car is for the mm -hmm. uh, Good job. Yes, next one. Yeah, 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 this, this is, this, is, is uh, this car is, is from, from Japan, Japan and, and that, that car is from uh, America. From, yeah. Perfect, perfect. Okay, so now we are going to label them. Okay, now you tell me, Hazar Rajulu, what do you notice here? Fragment. This Fragment, is... very good, because I see all over here, right? So, this is a fragment. So we're gonna say Haza Ismulishara Lil Borib Lil Muzakar Lilakar Singula What is Ar Rajulu? Is the Musharun Lai Musharunilai very good Musharunilai. So okay, let me write it down. Hajirunas. So Ismulishara, I'm gonna just write briefly. I'm not gonna write the whole thing. We don't have space over here, but you are supposed to write everything. So Haza is Ismulishara. Lil Muzakkar. And then Arrajulu, you're gonna say Musharu Nilay. Right? And mm. then um Tajirun. What is Tajirun doing here? It's khabar, right? Yeah. Tajirun is our khabar. Then where is my Muktada? Haza. 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 Just Haza? Haza. Haza Rajulu. The whole thing. Whole thing. Whenever we have fragment, Idafa hmm. fragment, Jar Majudur fragment, or whatever fragment we will learn, inshallah, even this pointer fragment, Basically, you are going to put them in one bucket. So let's say mm -hmm. I have a bucket over here. This is my Muktada bucket. And then I have another bucket, which is my Khabar bucket. Right? So Hazar Rajulu, the whole thing, I'm going to put into my Muktada mm -hmm. bucket. Right? And this Tajirun, the whole, this is just one word, so... Right? So that is going into my Khabar um, bucket. Khabar. Right? So Hazar Rajulu is my Muktada and uh, Tajirun is my Khabar. Um, Alhamdulillah. Okay, now next one was Ralika. Wow came. Do we know this wow? Huh? 
Arabic wow fa summa do you see this uh, uh, harf in quran e pak wow fa and even summa yes yeah. right so they are basically connectors they are connector so they translate as and then right so over here this wow is a connector harfuataf can can everyone remember that harfuataf yes yeah harfuataf okay so now zalika what is zalika ismul ishara lil bait and what is a rajulu rajulu is sharun ilai sharun ilai so basically then that it means they are one bucket they are together Muptada. they are chained together muptada right so muptada so this is muptada now break in the chain you can understand like that now so do you see ar rajulu has any relation with tabibun grammatically no no so there is break in the chain right yes right so when whenever there is break in the chain our is go there right yeah. so zalika rajalu that man is a doctor doctor so now this is my muttada this is my khabar assalamu alaikum ustada hmm yeah, we can say this one uh, break in the chain and also we can can we say it also proper followed by comma Yeah, we can say that as well. Okay, should that be? Yeah. Now, next one. Ismut Tajiri. What kind of construction is that? Mudaf and Mudaf like. Mudaf, yeah, Mudaf a fragment. Very good. So Ismu, it's not Ismun, right? It's not Al Is. It doesn't have Al on it, right? So mm -hmm. that is perfect for our idafa yeah. fragment. Idafa fragment. So now, ismu, and then we are going to check our next uh, isam as well. So next isam is what tajiri, right? So this is my mudafilay, and a tajiri is my mudafilayhi. Now. Ismu Tajiri, the name of the Tajir, 
mahmud now you tell me is there any relation between attajiri and uh, mahmud are they no. creating any fragment no 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 no, no. no. so then chain. there is break in the chain right yes and mm -hmm. ismu tajiri if i ask you what is the status uh, not status what is the type of this ismu common rafa no, when I say type, your answer should not be rafa. Proper. What does type mean? Proper. 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 How it is proper? It's more, there is a type. A is proper. Exactly. Okay. So since attajiru, the mudafilehi has all on it, right? So that is making our mudaf proper. So then we can say, okay, this is the alpha fragment is proper, right? So now proper followed by common, right? So our is should go there. So in that sense as well, this is my muqtada and Mahmoudun is my khabar. Yeah, proper followed by common, Mahmoudun is... Muhammadun is oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> this, is, this is the real, yeah. real break in the thing. Mutaji yeah. is Muftada and Muhammad is Khabar, isn't it? This one is the perfect example of breaking the chain. Muhammadun is Khabar. Yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, breaking the chain, yes, we can say. Yeah, so Mahmud, my bad. Okay, no. Mahmud is yeah. uh, yeah. Uh, no. common name, name, so it is Khabar. Yeah. So now, Ismu Tajiri is what? And the break in the chain we can apply over here, right? Yeah. 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 So break in the chain. So our is go there. So my is ismu tajiri is my muptada, Mahmudin is my khabar. Then um, teacher, we cannot we uh, can we say that uh, break in the if break in the chain is um uh, is come, then we can say that before the break in the uh, chain is will be the muftada and after that yeah, uh, yeah. if it is common so then the we can say the part before khabar. is yeah. muftada and part after is khabar. Khabar, yeah. Sister, so is wherever it... we have break in the chain, our is go in between them. <laughs> okay, so there mm -hmm. is break over here. I'm gonna put my is here. So the part before is muftada and part after is khabar. Khabar. Muptada, here Muptada can be one ism also. Of course, it is here. Muptada fragment. can be one ism. Muptada can be fragment. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. Yes. So, Muptada can be basically, you will learn a lot, inshallah, soon. Okay? okay this inshallah. is just the beginning. Then so, we say, okay. Ismut Tabibi Sayyidun. Ismut. Ism Vasmu, sorry. Vasmo, right? Again, wow is ataf. Harfu Okay, so harfu ataf connector and idafa fragment. Ismu. Ismu. Yes, again, ismu tabibi. Idafa fragment. Again, break in the chain. My is go there. This mm -hmm. is my muptada. This khabar. is my khabar. Saidun is khabar. Yeah. So the name of the doctor is Saeed. Saeed. Now, Hazal Baitu Litajiri. Now, Hazal Baitu. This is a fragment. This is a fragment. This is Musharun Ilai by Al Baitu. Exactly. So this is one bucket. Does it Al Baitu has any relation with this one here? No. 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 So break in the chain here. Right? Yeah. So my is go there. Hazal Baitu, the whole fragment is Muptada. This house. And the, now Litajiri. Can I call it Khabar or something else? Jar Yeah, since this is Jar Majroor, right? This is not word word. This is basically a fragment of Jar Majroor and we know that in Jumla Ismiya, when you are going to see Jar Majroor fragment, then you it can label MBK. it as MBK. MBK, MBK means Mutalik Bil Khabar. 
I am not clear like how you say that it's like there is a break in a chain. So if there is no break in a chain, what is that scenario? Okay, break in the chain mean that two words are not connected with each other grammatically. For example, we'll learn so far uh, Jar Majroor fragment. Right? Yeah. So if yeah. you have uh, fil bayti, right? Mm -hmm. If you have the word fi and then al bayti, right? Mm. If I ask you what is the connection in between these two isam, you're going to say fi is her fujar and al bayti is isam of isam this fi and yeah. this is isam majroor. So they yeah. have grammatical relation with each other, right? Okay. Then if you see a word like over here, Baitu Tajiri, if I ask you, does a Tajir has any relation with this Baitu, what should be your answer? Yes, it's Mudaf and Mudafile. Exactly. Now, this Atajiri, does it, this one has any relation with this ism over here? Grammatically? No. No. So that's why we are saying there is break in the chain, right? So they are separate and they are separate, okay. right? Okay. They do not Got have it. relation in between. So that okay. means there is break in the chain. And when there is break in the chain, our is can go there. Okay. Got it. Thank you. Jazakil. <clears throat> Okay. So, Sarah, real quick, can I ask a question, please? Yes. Uh, so, when you were doing Ismu Tajiri, Muhammadun, is that um, the the proper followed by common name uh, no. way? or No. No, we no. said, by mistake, I said Mahmudun is common. But you tell me, Mahmud can be common, even though no. it has the mean? No, no. Because it is a oh, proper yeah. name, right? Yes. So, Never it, mind. it cannot be common. Right? Yeah. So now right. over here, what can we say that, okay, Ismu Tajiri, they are related, they have relation with each other grammatically, but a Tajiru does not have any relation with Mahmud grammatically. Yes. Break up, break right? Up, so yeah. there is break in the chain. Jazakallah. Teacher, we'll have to see whether these uh, two uh, um, nouns side by side, it will not fall in any of the um, that is that the fragment then mm -hmm. then that is the breaking point yeah exactly yeah okay when there is no connection between two isam mm -hmm. then basically this is break in the chain okay inshallah when you teach i understand everything after when i think that i make make a mess listen to the uh, uh, recording one more time that's gonna help you inshallah inshallah one time is not we are not that smart Yes. Some people are, alhamdulillah, but Teacher, not everyone, even me, I need to like drill things in my mind. Teacher, right? on top of that, I'm getting older now. Yeah. So I can remember that's the main Everyone thing. Everyone is getting old, not only you. <laughs> no, right? I'm quite yeah, older. Yeah, it is happening to problem. everyone. Every second and every inshallah, minute. Inshallah, inshallah. You're getting older and older. No, but uh, I should highly appreciate you. Your technique of teaching is so nice. I didn't have any teacher like this in my life. I'm quite old. Alhamdulillah. 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 Pray for me that I can remember the thing. I want to understand the Quran very uh, clearly in my own language. If I read, then if I understand my, the Quran. Inshallah. 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 Whenever there is a will, there is a way. Right? Inshallah. I'm trying so my you best. Have will, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will grant you, inshallah, what you are wishing inshallah, for. Inshallah. Okay, now, uh, where we were? Baitu Tajiri Amam al Masjidi. Now, this Amam al Masjidi, how I can label it? What is my label here? MBK. MBK. Yes. MBK. Why MBK? Because so it's Zarf. Mudaf and this is Zarf, Makkah, right? 
and all my ZERF, basically, they are going to be labeled as MDK in Joomla Ismiya. Now, next one, Baitu Tabibi. Do they have relation? Yes. Yes. What relation? So they are one bucket. Now, yeah. Al Tabibi and Al Khalafa, do they have any grammatical relation? No. 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 So there is break in the chain. Al -al right? Yeah. Yes. Break and now, this Baitu Tabibi in. The house of the doctor is right? so this is my Muktada and Alfal Madrasati is my Khabar. MBK. Oh, oh sorry, MBK. Yeah. Then then Khalfal Madrasati is Mudaf Mudafilai. Yeah. So Khalfa is Mudaf, Madrasati is Mudafilahi, yes. Special Mudaf. Zarf, you can call. Okay. Okay. But, Liman Hazi says, but, there, but there is no khabar in it. There is one. Yeah, Muktada. it's okay. It's I told okay. you guys okay. that either there is going to be a khabar or MBK. If one of them is present, good enough. Okay. okay. So we are not going to be worried about, okay, where is my khabar? It's okay if there is MBK. So MBK is basically representing khabar, replacing khabar. Okay. Okay. Next one. Hazi his sayara to litabibi. A question we are not going to analyze. So just leave that alone. But we can just label it. Okay. If I ask you, Liman, how are you gonna label it? Question questioning word Liman. So Li Li is her fujar basically. Mm -hmm. Man is a majroor. Majroor. Right? Yes. And then Hazi is Sayarati is our pointer fragment. Right? Liman is MBK. Huh? Yeah. Liman. Yeah. Uh, the, yeah, so basically, yeah. 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 this yeah. is MDK. Yeah. Okay, okay, next one. Hazi his sayara to litabibi. Hazi his sayara to are they together? One bucket? Yes, it's a yes. fragment. Yes. Litabibi is one bucket? Yeah, litabibi no, no. one bucket. Yes. Is there a break in the chain? Yes. Yeah. Yes. So this is my Muktada. This is my MB. MBK. MBK. Vatilka litajiri. Now tilka. I told you guys all these pointer. Now you, after this tilka, do we have al? Yes. No. 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 We have no. al. No. 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 It's breaking the chain. Litajiri is MBK. Jarmur. Yeah. So tilka is by itself over here. And these yes. all these pointer can be our muktada. Yes. MBK. MBK. So this is Tilka is Muktada and Litta Jiri is MBK. Perfect. Hazi his sayara tu. Muktada. Muktada. Minal Yabani. MBK. MBK. Why I'm having a pause over here? It's a uh, break in the chain. Yeah. <clears throat> right? So this car is from, from Japan. Yaban. But Tilka mean Amrika. So now Tilka is my Muptada. Min Amrika is my MBK. And do you guys notice Min Amrika? Even though there is mean, yes. right? But then, still it is ka. Broken. Broken. Why? Because this is one of the some, it is not going to budge. Doesn't matter what flexible. comes before yeah. it, okay? But we know mean has come, so this is our isamajrur. 
mm-hmm. even though it's not showing us jar status this is non flexible because sometimes they yeah. say say ameriki what is um no that is ameriki yun this is like someone belongs to america citizen like a citizen yeah so they have yun ameriki yun like we say pa- pakistani yun they don't have pa they have ba right so pakistan pakistan is pakistan right and yes. then if i say niun what does that mean i pakistani. am pakistani yeah pakistani i am a pakistani i am a pakistani or canada Can- canadian we canadian. say right so it will be in arabic can can di yun Canadian, like Canadian. I am Canadian. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I, I want to take a picture. Could you please? Picture of what? This page. <laughs> the translation. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Go ahead. You, you would hardly be able to read Understand. it. Understand. <laughs> it's so messy. <clears throat> Mm-hmm. i have a question so all the country names are um, non flexible yes like I mean, partly flexible we say them partly not, because partly yeah mukattu yeah mukattu yeah. yeah but when we put al on them then it is a different story because in you can say al yabani right al amrit so al came al came and now it is it, it is taking kasra So, inshallah, we are going to talk about it later. Sister, this minal yabani is not jar majroor because min is... It is. Okay, but you say this is MBK. So it's MBK is jar majroor. Yes. MBK, whenever in Jumla Ismiya, we have MBK. Is jar uh, Sorry, in, uh, in Jumla Ismiya, we have jar majroor. We always give them label of MBK, right? Oh, yeah. ज you can try as much as well and basically these are same example that we did lot of them so you guys can try that and uh, then it has over here it says answer the following questions so simple this is all from the lesson you need to answer the questions and then this homework over here it says that uh, you need to answer for example first you need to make a question and then you need to answer it so liman hazal kitabu so for this book is for who and then you gonna say hazal kitabu li muhammadin so the first one is already done for you okay so inshallah that is easy and simple you guys can do that homework number 2 is again basically same thing and uh, this is the key Uh, but you are not uh, going to look at it until you try your best and over here you are going to give them haraka right so mm-hmm. ha hazal wala du right and then khalidun wa zalikal waladu muhammadun so you are going to give all these harakas okay so do you do you guys think that you would be able to finish that should we continue next class next lesson or uh, we need to work on this one i think we can do it inshallah yeah because i don't think see anything Easy. hard over there we, mm-hmm. yeah we d- did everything and basically this is all repetition what we did so inshallah do that whatever is left and uh, next class we can move on uh, with our next lesson inshallah 
سو بارک اللہ علی ولاکم فل قرآن الحکیم ونا فانی و یاکم بھی آیات و ذکر الحکیم سبحان اللہ و بھی ہم دکھا نشد اللہ اللہ انتا و نست فروکا و نست فروکا و نست فروکا و نتوب الیک سبحان ربی کا رب العزتی اما یاسفونا و سلام علمسلین الحمد للہ رب العالمین جزاکم اللہ خیرن کسیرہ جزاکم اللہ خیرن کسیرہ